Hey everyone, welcome to the Mega Monday. Today, I just thought I'd come on to give you just a brief summary of how the week's been going and what I plan to do in the future and what my current addiction is. Please help me. So it's pretty much been the first week back onto the daily YouTube game and it seems to have gone down pretty damn well. I'm really happy that people are enjoying the playthrough of Wonder Boy and have enjoyed the Vegeta plays and the Sonic Mania level stuff. That being said, oh boy, do we have a doozy next week. Of course, we'll be continuing the Let's Play of Wonder Boy. That's been going down really well, and I'm really happy with how quickly I've been able to make progress and just generally enjoying the game a bunch as well. I actually have an update on the Freedom Planet 2 demo that I want to show off that has a bunch of new animations and some changes, as well as a bunch of new moves for the characters we've seen before. So it was just a kind of a, like a catch me up, essentially, and just an excuse to play it again, to be fair. Other things to note, though, is that the weekend of recording, the weekend just gone um dragon ball fighter z or dragon ball fighters had a beta that i actually decided to record some matches of so if you're into dbz fighting games then you'll be all about those videos of course we have the second video of sonic uh weekly sonic stuff and who oh boy let me tell you if you're a big fan of some annoying mods and hacks of back in the day like some og stuff you are in for a treat I don't know if a treat is the right word, but it's certainly a thing. And one of the other things that have recently been released was Yume Nikki on Steam, surprisingly. So the famous RPG Maker horror game, I don't even know if I can call it a horror game in my eyes. It is a bit surreal and weird, so maybe. But it came out on Steam and I decided to just play it around with it a little bit to show it off just to introduce it to people who may not have seen it before. And that's kind of what we got going for the YouTube channel uh, this week. As for streaming, I've uh, got planned some odd games. We beat Fury actually last weekend, a kind of top-down, I don't know what you would call it, like a fighter almost? It was It's basically a fighter game, but then it goes into like twin stick shooting and stuff. It's really cool though, and it was tough and a lot of fun, so check that out. But yeah, this week we have a weird one called uh, do Jana do something? Oh wow, I actually got the name right. Yeah, it looks really odd. So I'm all about that. I'm gonna jump right in this uh, today actually. <laughs> but if you're not here just to hear what the week has in store, um, man, I have been addicted to VR chat so bad and it's so much fun. <laughs> it's one of those things that I jumped into to join a friend, to join Martin, um, to actually just play around and, and hang out. And now I've stopped. I can't stop. I, I haven't stopped. <laughs> kind of gives me nostalgia for the good old days back when I was, you know, first starting out on the internet and getting all these uh, instant messenger things going on. But it's a lot more fun this way because I've taken to kind of acting out as characters, not necessarily mimicking what they do within their very things, but just doing their voice. It's like good practice, basically. And a lot of people seem to appreciate that. They are very, very uh, impressed a lot of the time. I've had a lot of people impressed, surprisingly. Um, especially with Vegeta, especially when I, you know, reveal that my normal voice is that of a British accent and they get very confused. <laughs> it's been a lot of fun and I'd love to have a original model in there, just like one that represents me, like a anime 3D version of me, I suppose, but that would take a lot of work on my part that I just, I don't have the skills for, <laughs> but, uh, you know, just doing it as these characters is actually a lot of fun. Don't get me wrong, I'd love to do videos on it or stream it, but I feel like I'd rather have it in VR and I don't have a VR headset yet. I want to get one now. All of these amazing titles out there that have all these VR capabilities and what do I want VR for? Fucking VR chat, of course. Then again, I know tons of things I'd play with the VR. I'd, I'd probably play Elite Dangerous. I'd play Subnautica. Oh man, Subnautica would be a nightmare. But it, I would do so much with that. I hope that my room would be big enough for it. I mean, I've seen I've seen people get away with worse, so I'd probably be okay. But yeah, that's been my life. If you ever are on VR chat and happen to see a Mega G Wolf running around, if I'm Vegeta, chances are that is me. Um, 
I mean, you could always ask me, and I'll just, uh, hey, are you the Mega G Wolf? And I'll be like, last time I checked in the mirror. So yeah, there's there's tons of things I'd like to do. I am going to start saving up for a VR headset. Don't know how well that'll go, considering I'm terrible at saving. Um, and really, I do have other things I should be getting. So I'll see. I'll see. I mean, I'm perfectly fine with it just being the keyboard and mouse setup I have now. What I really want to focus on is getting some custom avatar stuff. Uh, if I can mess with that at some point, but that's just a project I'll probably work on later. Either way, guys, thanks for tuning in for a little follow-up, a uh, little catch-up of the brand new content coming out. I hope you're enjoying it. I'm really, really enjoying making it. It's like, it's... I know I said this before, but I was really excited to get back into this, and this just proves it. Like, I am super invested into this. The only downside is right now, because of the whole VR chat addiction, I need to get myself out of it. I really need to, like, discipline myself, because I've been sitting on Mario Odyssey for pixelated bites for a while, and I really should get to finishing that, especially considering I did want to get a second video out for the month. Um, uh, that's not... It's not guarantee, but it's like, in my head, I had it planned to try and do it like that. I imagine I might be able to. But yeah, it's just one of those things, you know? You know how it, how it gets when you get something brand new and you, you're trying to, trying to get as much time into it, but also get your work done? This is, why, this is why doing YouTube is a lot harder than people make it out to be. You have to discipline yourself. Uh, you have to get in a mindset or else you start, you know slacking off. I've actually also been playing games that I've been meaning to have played last year as well. That's the whole reason why I played Fury. I've been playing near Auto Tomato, um, and that has been really fun so far, but uh, I kind of want to step back from that a little bit. Um, probably to play more VR chat. No, but to actually get work done. Um, <laughs> But uh, yeah, I'll probably get back to playing that eventually too. Either way, guys, thanks for listening in. I hope you have a wonderful week. I hope you have a wonderful day, whatever. Hopefully I'll see you at the stream. If not, I'll see you next time. Take care. Okay, thanks. Bye. Come on.